guys, this is Versta from Game Dexterity. So this is part three of the Excellent Kai tutorial series. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can take your original Xbox and play it online. And we're going to use Halo 2 as an example. For sake of time, please see the first portion of the video, the part one. I, I teach you about what is the program and how to set up your static IP address. And for those that are curious, I'm using a crossover cable. So if I go to my network adapter and I go to my... Um, TCP IPv4, I am having a static IP address of this, 192.168.1.123. Similarly, on my Xbox, I have a different static IP address, and then life should be good. So I press OK, I click on Close. To help save some time, I already started the Excellent Kai program. So let's go into Xbox, and then we'll go to First Person Shooter, and then we'll scroll all the way down to like Halo 2, because that's a lot of people there. It's always a lot of people. And then we go to Latin America, and then Solo Retos. And then here, this is where you can either host your own game or join someone's game. So like for example, if I were to click on someone's game over here on the left hand side, momentarily their names will pop up here if life is good. And then you can go ahead, go to your Xbox and join the game. So with that said, let's jump straight into that video tutorial. Alright, so here we are at the main menu of my Xbox. I'm actually using a modded Xbox, so I have the Unleash X dashboard installed. But if you want to set up your static IP address, go down to System, go to Settings, Go down to Network and go ahead and set up your static IP address. So here's my IP address 192.168.1.25. Something that masks 255, 255, 255, Gateway is the gateway of your router IP address. So 192.168.1.1. You go all the way down to the bottom and then you click on Save and then that's it. Okay, so let's go ahead and start my Halo 2 game. Launch DVD. And just like I said earlier in the video, I'm using a crossover cable. If you want to use the router method, you can definitely do that. Just make sure that um, if you want, you can set up static IP address or you can just turn on DHCP mode and the Xbox will get its own IP address automatically. All right, so let's, well, I can't skip the movie stuff, so let's just watch it. There we go. Let's turn on the audio a little bit higher. All right, so the deuce, uh, don't sign in, that's fine. Go to system link, select your profile, and here, let me try to find a game real quick, hang in tight. All right, sweet, so I'm back. What I did was I exited out, went back to the main lobby, and now I see there's a lot of games going on. So let's go ahead and find someone's game. I'll just pick a random game here, and then uh, this is fine. Wait for the leader, and momentarily we'll be in the game. Now, I am by no means a Halo 2 expert. I get my butt kicked all the time. But at least you guys can see that, yeah, this does work. This is awesome. Unfortunately, a lot of people just like to play Halo 2. They don't play any other game, which sort of sucks. So it's sort of better if you can sort of find your friends to help you um, play online. But yeah, if you like this type of video, please like, favorite, and subscribe. So that hopefully one day we can get to the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, if you got any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page. And I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.